What's up, gentlemen and gentle ladies? This is going to be the last clip of the week, even though it's already Monday. Me and my bro are heading home on icy roads. And uh, I don't think it's still snowing, but uh, it's certainly slick out. It's supposed to snow until 9. Until 9 this morning? At least there's plows out in town, right? Yeah, that's when we get out of town. Then our life may be in jeopardy. So this could very well be the last video you guys ever hear me in. Let's hope that's not the case. How morbid. How, how predicting that would be if it ended up being true. All right, I'm done with that conversation. Yes. Anyways, how was, how was work, brother? Tiresome. You're more than ready to go to bed, huh? But you get a couple days off. Are you gonna go to Area 51? No. Ah. Decided against it. Why? I'm gonna wait till it's a little warmer to where I don't freeze my ass off out there. Ah. I wish I'd be going to Area 51. I think that's you, something you and me should do someday. Like a a bucket list thing. You and I go fly past the camel dudes. Well, we go sneak into Area 51 Save and up uh, enough money to bond ourselves out. Yeah. Get the car out of impound. Or we could just, you know, make it a the last thing we do in our life. <laughs> Go as far in as we can while live streaming on Twitch. <laughs> I see Paul. Wonder how many people will get that reference. Anyone that knows a good comedy movie. Not an alien. Paul. What's better, Ted or Paul? Well, of course, Ted. Paul was pretty fucking funny, though. Paul was like the alien version of Ted, you know that? Yeah. Oh. He's like the alien off of uh, Family Guy, or uh, American Dad. Yeah. Wasn't that his name? No, that was Doug. Uh, actually, his name was J-Rod. The alien on, on American Dad, his real name's J-Rod? Mm -hmm. That's funny. What do they call him on there? Um, Paul. No, Roger. Roger. J Rod. Alright. Sounds like a porn star name. Right? So, are you going to still try and get Wednesday and Thursday? Or you should try and get Thursday off. Because I've pretty much got that one in the bucket. And if you just trade this Thursday and work for her next uh, Wednesday. Then you and I can get 12 hours of extra overtime, and they would get 12 hours of extra overtime. We're kind of like doing a quid pro quo for each other. You see? You get like five days out of seven days off this week. Why you don't want to check where you have almost nothing on it? I gotta pay attention, brother. All right, I understand. I understand. Alright, people. Probably gonna sign out at this time. Since we're getting on the highway. Things, it doesn't look like the highway's been fully plowed yet. So, uh, I know. In the, I'm from places where there's a lot more snow than this. And this is kind of like a wuss's amount of snow. So, people that haven't been in a lot of snow think this is dangerous and scary. Well, it is for a rear wheel drive car that has a bald tire in the back. Doesn't look, yeah, they are. At least on this side, I don't know. Yeah, they're on on both sides. Alright, talk to you guys later, man. Lots of sliding. That's how slick it is out, you guys. This is all because my dad must have his coffee. Must have his coffee. Jeez. Oh, that's the final clip of the week, you guys. Talk to you later. See you on the next clip for the next week. 
What's up, ladies and gentlemen? I wanted to do the first clip of a new week. Check it out, and it's me showing you guys my new, uh, my new collectible or toy, depending on who it is you're talking to. Uh, I figured I collected enough uh, X Men stuff for now, and uh, so I'm gonna add a little something else to my little collection of uh, awesome '90s memorabilia because I'm stuck in the '90s. Help me, help me, I'm stuck in the 90s and I can't get out. Uh, I don't think actually that Back to the Future is a 90s movie, is it? I think it's an 80s movie. This is specifically Back to the Future 2, though, so I believe that was made in the 90s. Uh, but check it out, it's pretty cool. Uh, it kind of takes a little bit of work to get to go through all the little lighting effects, so I'm going to go ahead and turn it on to try me mode. So it turns on all the lights. Well, it turns on just that, those part, parts of the lights. I don't think it's turning on the back of them. Right, we'll turn it on normal mode so we can see some of the normal lighting effects. Open up the, uh, the door. the uh the flux capacitor gotta get this to zoom or to auto focus there let's try that again that's pretty cool all the little stuff on the inside lights up just like it should would in the movies I wish this phone did a better job autofocusing. The detail on this thing is impressive, though. I really, I'm really impressed by it. Gonna be the passenger. Check it out. Get that autofocus going again. Oh my gosh! Focus for me, people. Uh, you know, they make great cameras, cell phone cameras, but they need to start working on the speed of the autofocus on it. I mean, jeez. But I think that's about all it does. I think next we're going to see all the lights turn on. Where we're going, we don't need roads. <laughs> Just a second. All right, we're back. I had to clean the lens on there. We need some plutonium, Marty. Anyways, yeah. Uh, so it's really detailed, really nicely done. I'm impressed by it. Uh, it was forty bucks. I don't like spending that much money on stuff, but you know what? I'm work. I'm overcoming that because you know. If I want cool collectibles, I'm going to have to spend the money. And we're out of time for this clip, you guys. So I'll see you on the next clip. See later. Happy birthday, Titan. Hey, did you know you're officially two years old today? Do you realize that? Do you realize you're two years old? You're getting old, man. You're getting old. I'm gonna have to, you're no longer a puppy, so I'm going to have to get rid of you now. Because I only want puppies in my life. Puppies! Puppy! You can't puppies. call you a pupper anymore. You're officially, you're officially a doggo. Congratulations. This is this is your beer for dogs. There you go. Because you you're you're an you're puppers. an adult dog now. Did you know all dogs are puppers? He's a doggo. But not all doggos are. 
Not all puppers are doggers. Is my dog a pupper? Yep. Or a doggo? No, he's a pupper. He's a doggo still. He's a pupper. Doggo. He's a pupper. Whatever you say. Happy birthday, buddy.